don't know at the moment. Uh, it will most probably be in Bloemfontein. You know, I think we, you know, judging by the phone calls we get, the, all the sympathies we get from all over the province, all over the country, and even from abroad, Hansi belonged to the country, and, and I think the whole country is stunned by this. You know, had he been 60, 70 years old, one would expect, yes, you know, you would expect a person of that age. But at the age of 32, uh, it, it is a blow, a terrible blow to the family and, and also to the, to the whole country, I think, to will. And we must abide by it. We've got a lot of faith, the Kroniers, and Hansi had a lot of faith. And, um, you know, as, as the day drew on, we realized, uh, you know, one must expect the worst and uh, when we got the news you it's it's like it's like telling someone but it can't be true but 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 yet it is true but one gets strength from up above uh, he made a mistake but the wonderful thing is uh, that he was not afraid to say, I've done something wrong. And he got the forgiveness of the Lord, and he is a free person, uh, and uh, that's why we will mourn his uh, death very much. I'm very sad. He was such a nice man, such a good Christian, and that's all.